So for anybody that wasn't around back in 2017, uh, we originally discovered Recurse thanks to Eddie Riofa, who is a um, regular in the stream. Um, puzzler extraordinaire and PA masterclass. Um, he introduced us to Recurse and basically it's just a game I absolutely fell in love with, um, loving puzzle games as I do. Um, so we completed it like everything. Um, with the game um, and just recently the DLC has been released and it's been probably about a month maybe a little bit more but um, yeah we intend to get back into Recursed and uh, play this DLC um, both here live on Twitch and on YouTube so um, we enter the next Nexus we should have the Ice Palace pot right at the top so um, this is the Ice Palace. There are 3, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, I think, puzzles. Um, they estimate that there is about, I think it's about 14 hours of gameplay potentially, depending on how good you are at puzzle solving, I guess. Uh, but let's jump into easy mode because I need to remember control. I think it's just jump, right, isn't it? I think so. Um... Okay, so it's E to pick up. Oh, right, okay. So this is gonna, <laughs> I'll be honest, this is gonna take quite some time to get used to again. Um, get used to all the controls, remember what all the puzzle pieces do, etc., etc. So, why is that there? That's interesting. So yeah, the blue thing is like a clone thing. So the minute you pick anything up, you get taken back through. That's right. So maybe I want to do... But thinking about it, if I take the... There was a way to get down here, wasn't there? There we go. Hold jump. So I think if I go in here, though... Yeah, that's going to instantly turn, isn't it? But... Okay, so that's the pot. So maybe if I just now take... Hey, we got our first one. Fan Dabby Dozy. All right, we're not so rusty at this as I thought. That's excellent. Excellent news indeed. All right, well, there's not really a lot we can go here. We're going to the chest. Where does that take me, I wonder? And underwater. Okay, so got to remember that if we go into a chest on the water, the area becomes flooded, doesn't it? Alright, we are... We are restarting because we have messed things up. Maybe we need to take this out of here, though. This room kind of seems a bit redundant once we have the chest. So we could technically have a light and a dark one here. Sorry, a light and a dark. Man, I've been playing too much older. Um... So we can do this. So that takes me back to the edge here. Okay, so if I bring a chest through, do I want to take this one out? Possibly. Oh, 
Oh, but I can't. I can't take it out, can I? So those blocks there cause things to float. I think I may have screwed the pooch on this one because I don't think I can now solve this puzzle. Unless I can get anywhere that's got a bit of dry land, but... Uh, actually, yes, I can. Okay. So, let's pick up the chest. Go through into here. I'm going to go into here. But I think we're going to need to take a chest through here with us, right? So, if we get this and take this one. But then... Hold on. Uh, no, because I don't need to do that. That's, that's the right thing to do, but I may have just, again, screwed the pooch. It seems. Yeah, I think I can. I can't do anything now that I threw that chest into here. Okay. I wonder if taking this into here and then submerging this one in the water, I wonder if that does anything for us. Could potentially cause a paradox. Could it cause a paradox? No. Alright. Man, my recurse is rusty. is very rusty. So I need a key now. So you can get from here. See, the problem is, what if I jump down here, then I do this. I can't get back up to here. So... The question for me is... How do I raise that up? How do I raise it up? but also be able to access it. Or failing that, how do I... Don't do that. How do I get down that side? How do I get down that side? Let's 
So here I have nowhere where I can use dry land. I can't even remember what I did before now, which is depressing. Can't remember what I did. Definitely didn't do that, that's for sure. I think I took this into here. I have to jump here. From here I can take this into here. And get a secondary chest with this. That allows me passage back. So I'm now thinking I go in the water with this. But that wouldn't do me any good. Because of that floating there. So there's no point in doing that. So, I need, I think I need, I think I need one of the chests that takes me into this room. I forgot how good these songs were on the soundtrack. So I can take the same one twice. So I could really do with that now being submerged, but I got no way of submerging it from here. So I think it's this room that I need to duplicate take through. So that's in here, isn't it? Okay. Yes, it's behind this one here, isn't it? Okay, so now I've got this room duplicated. Now I can go get... Oh, no, I need the key from the other room. That's right, this room. Ooh. How many of these rooms am I going to make? So 
So I'm not really gaining any progress here, am I? I'm just recreating the same rooms over and over and over again. So we're here, but this isn't what I said I wanted to do, was it? Because that will just give me this room again. All right, so this doesn't help. like creating rooms rooms over rooms over rooms right now can't get the blocks to got no way back so I need to take I gotta take one of these this room that I'm in now that I've just left this not this one So I've got to take this into here, but I need it to be dry. Right. Yes. See, so I need to do it into here. Then I need to replicate this room. Okay. Okay. So this room is actually no good for us. We can't use this because we have to use a a wet room, so to speak. But I need to go back and get the chest. Oh man, the story of my recurse playthrough. It's haunting me. Right, jump in here. Now I need to go and get this one back. Okay. So now I have my two rooms here. Right, so this one needs to now be down here. Let's take them both down here, just in case. Has to be down here because we have to return to get the key. So I can take this into here. No, okay, I need another one of, I think I need another one of these chests. Oh, but I 
it on dry land. Okay, so I take this one into here. We then lose this one, but that should be fine. We shouldn't need another one of these now. Okay. So now I have two of these chests. Both submerged in water. I can jump into either one of these to get the key. Okay, so now I have to take one of these into here. No, because I need the chest. Oh, jeez. Do I take that up to the dry area? Sure, if I get another block, I'll be able to get out. Okay. So if I can get another block, I'll be able to get out of here. That's what we're working towards. Leave that one here. Jump back through to here. But, oh, um. Maybe. Oh, I've done it. I've inadvertently done it. Jeez, I wasn't expecting to solve that. All right, number three is Cliff. So, a um, bit of recursed, or recursed, recursed background. Um, anything with a, a green glow on it like that will persist between um, when you open and close chests, basically. Normally things would disappear. Uh, and this is as they will remain, so. That's interesting. Not a ledge. So I think what I'll do now is I'll get this back. Hmm. Take this in first, then go back for the key. I think I used the wrong key. I think that key is a is a ruse.
I didn't bring the block back out. I need to bring the block back out before I um, did that. Okay. Bring the block out. I think I'm going to need another one. So. How do we get the other block? Or how do we keep getting blocks? Put this down here. That's fine. We can use the key on the here. All right, let's just try this a moment. So we're going to drop this. any favors we need to use this block I think do you see how that helps because when I go back through this portal now, we're going to lose. We will lose one of these blocks. Unless. trick is to get the I can say is the trick to get the key out every time but How does that really help? I don't see that it does. Because now I haven't got a key. So I'm back to exactly the same thing we had before. Just with one less key. No trickery we can do with like moving chests because clearly we don't have the ability to do that. Is it possible to stockpile a load of keys? But then how would that help me? Because we need a block to stockpile the keys. So it means we've always got to put a block down there. Am I like sure I can't, can't like jump up here? 
Yeah. Ain't happening, is it? So I can only ever, at the minute I can only see a way to ever get one block. Am I missing? So your block won't stay on here. This platform items fall straight through these platforms. So the only way to get this key out of here if I need to use it is with a block. So we could put the green block down here. If I put the green block down here, I then can't access that block over there. So my first move has to be to get a block. Right? So it makes sense though, not to use this one again. But this is, this is my point. This is like, this is where the recursion is because by doing this, I never gain a new block. I'm always stuck with two blocks. Unless I can save the first key. But by saving the first key, I can't open this. Because I'd have to put this block down here in this bottom left hand corner. And I then wouldn't be able to get up to the block in the top right corner. So I can't save the first key, right? Can't jump into the key with the chest? Maybe that's the thing. <laughs> it's not <clears throat> so 
So this is a thing. And where does one go from here? So no point trying to take a key back now because I will just be in exactly the same situation where I have one key up top, one key at the bottom. So the next logical move has to be to open this door. Okay. Does this do anything? Screws the pooch. All right. So we have to unlock the door. To which I think that's the next move. So, Next up, we have a block. So we know to get this key, we need to use a block to stand on. Which would make sense to use the green block. So we put the green block down there. We return back with the cube. So then that gives us a block outside, a block inside, and a way to open up the thing. Forget the key. We're more interested in the block. So now we can effectively reset what we had at the beginning. Okay, this is where we stockpile our keys. This is where we stockpile the keys. Okay. I was right about stockpiling keys. Uh, let's get five, just to be safe. I don't know how many we're going to actually want here. Because then what we'll do is we'll bring the cube, the other box through. We'll swap it with the one that can persist. And then we'll just be able to take out as many cubes as we want. I believe. So, cube. Swap it for this one. You know what? Let's take another key just for save ourselves. So now we don't actually have to use the key area anymore. It's just a case of taking these out, but also remembering each time to bring this one out here. Or else it gets trapped behind. No, we've got keys. We don't need to worry about that. We have keys. Just breaking it down into its like simplest form is clearly the way to go. Just analyzing every single little move that you can do. Future kids. There we go. 
Excellent. All right, these ones are locked, so we've got to go. Let's start going all the way around the outside. All right, side effect. So we have two, two cubes that keep. Oh, right. So if I remember. I'm sure the red stuff burns the enchantments off, doesn't it? Yes, it does. Okay, so we're going to need to take the chest into there. school. I need to go back, not forwards. There we go. So, I see what I need to do, I think. So, first of all, we need to bring... Oh, wait, though. That's going to burn off the enchantment, isn't it? Doesn't necessarily matter. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. No. Maybe it will matter. Because that's now not in here, is it? Oh. If I go back, that's going to be lost, isn't it? That's not going to be now in the original room. See, once the enchantment burns off, I need to put them in a safe place. I wonder.
All right, so I can't abuse it. I was thinking I could possibly abuse the situation. Let me get a couple of these. So we're going to put these both here. So what I'm attempting to do here is just be really quick about things. that there. Okay, that's good. So now... I just need to race as quickly as I can to get two keys. Please still be there. Yes. No! All right, that was it though. That was it. So. Uh, I need to restart. That was wrong. I need to use this first to get one of the other chests. Take this one. Wait for the enchanting to wear off. Oh, that's not really going to help, is it?
Okay. There we go. All right. First four down. Sack is next. Okay, we have the ability to create a pot. Oh, excuse me. So I can't do that. I can't throw that up there like that. I wonder if I take the chest into the pot. I'll take the block into the pot first, into the chest first. Take the chests into the pot. I need to bring that out with me. I need to bring a block out with me. Can't do that, can I? Forgot about that. Thank you. 
I don't feel like I'm making progress here. The aim here has got to be. Hold on, we, can, we create the pot first, right? Okay. So the aim is we need to get a block in here so that we can then get out with the key so i can jump up to here on my own but once i pick up the key i can't right so we need to bring a block into this room is what we need to do okay Did that the wrong way round. Oh, I may have just screwed myself. Okay, it's getting, I don't know why we seem like it's getting complicated, but I think I know what, I think I know what I'm doing. How reassuring is that? Okay. Why did I pick up the key? Ah, oh. all right, well. We may have gone a long way around it, but we did work that out, so. Let's try to remember what we did.
How's that going to help? Now I just bring a block back. I've forgotten how I did it. I can't believe I inadvertently solved it. Oh, and now I can't remember what I did. No. first one basically I need to bring in so in this one I need to have two blocks basically and then okay so that's that's what I need here that's all done and dusted so this is my ending pot right here so now in the others I need to work to get the key up to the top, right? Yes, okay, so I do this and then I go in here again. This is how I get the key up to the top. Chest in the pot, not. Okay. Key is now at the top. Why? Oh, why? Didn't I? Why didn't I put the key down? Alright, I gotta restart because I've I've messed it up. I can't destroy that pot. That pot has
has to stay. My objective. Oh, no, it's not. Putting the key up to the top is my objective. Sorry. I think I've actually remembered the sequence of events now. Is at the top. Hallelujah, praise the Lord. Now I need a block. So now I need to bring a block back. This is where it might get a little bit tricky. shafted just yet. Take that into and take a block into there. I think I need to create another pot. All right, so I've got pots everywhere. Let's see what happens. It's not going to hurt us. Take the pot into the pot. No. I now screw myself. Because I can't now get out there. Hmm. This one is a doozy. Hey, Eddie, what's going on, buddy? Yeah, I, I worked out I need to get the key up to the top first, which I've done, but then I need to get um, 
I need the two blocks here. Weird thing was, I kind of inadvertently solved it, but for some stupid reason, I picked up the key and took it to the lower level after I'd gone through here, once the key was in here, and then I was like... Ugh. So, weirdly, I'd solved it. But I don't know how I did it. I just did it. But my, my feeling is, what I need to do is I need to bring... I've been trying to... I've been saying I need to get the key up here first. What if I can actually manage to... Maybe the key doesn't need to go up there. I'm just trying to think whether or not I need to get the key up there first or whether or not I could just try and bring a cube back. Yeah. The block is the issue that I'm struggling with, definitely. Also taking me a little bit of a while to get back into kind of like the way, the way of recursed. Alrighty, no worries, buddy. Catch you later. So that's the key sorted. You see, the problem is now, I... Um, say so I almost need to create four cubes don't I See, that's fine. Yeah, I need that. I need that extra cube, though. Because then I come back to here, and I'm just back to the the single.
right, so... Alright, matey, no worries. I mean, I'm probably... I mean, I've done all the puzzles up to this one so far, so... Um, I don't know how much longer I will be going for. If I'm honest. No, I didn't want to go in the pots. Alright, maybe not all doom and gloom just yet. Let's see. Alright, it is doom and gloom. All right, so it's not actually, it's not too bad. We've just got to create some more pots now. Uh, oh dear. I've lost my chest. No! Alright, well. No worries on that, Eddie. I appreciate that. Um... Oh, wait a second. Oh, snap. All right. I hope you're keeping count on these, uh, this level of recursion going on here. Personally, Eddie, but Okay. So I could take this out if I wanted. I don't think that would be a wise move at the moment. So now I have this. Good luck with your exams already. Take it easy. All right, so this is my... I know what I've done wrong here. I should have taken... Each time I jumped into the pot, I should have taken... Yeah. I think each time I jumped into the pot, I should have taken another block with me. Okay. Let's just do it twice for now, I think. Uh, do it three times. What's the worst that could happen? Okay.
jump in here. I feel like this is kind of on the right lines. Maybe I need to have a pot here though. So that's not really achieved anything, has it? Doing that. Um, yeah, I don't. This will just put this on here, won't it? <sighs> this one's pretty tough. Having to get it up in that higher segment. It's not easy. I'm convinced that's the opening move though. Kind of makes to getting the key out, like he said, was pretty 
easy. Oh, but then I've lost the... I've lost the chest and the block in here. All right, well... <laughs> probably a good place to end tonight i'm going to keep these streams relatively short i don't think there's worth um it's worth kind of like overstimulating myself um like almost killing myself to work these out and being stuck here for hours and hours um as with portal i'm probably have a play around with it off camera see if i can make any progress but i think that's definitely i think the opening move is definitely there it's definitely there with the um uh, taking the chest into the pot, getting the key up to the top. But then obviously I don't really want to take the, I don't want to take the key out. I want to get a block out first, thinking about it. So what I think I need to do is I need to stack it, I need to get a thing of three, take the chest up to the top, jump into the chest. So I, I'm actually thinking about this wrong. All right. Let me just play this out in my head. So what I actually need to do is get the chest up to the top. Right, so in here I need to make a three. I need to get the three going in here. key up here as well. I mean, the key's like the last thing anyway. So it needs to get a block out. out. I think this is how I get the block out. Something along these lines. Hmm. 
Maybe not. Alright, well, I've got some ideas to play with. I, th I think I'm kind of getting on the right line, but not quite there. So, I will play around with it for a little bit longer. Thank you very much, though, for tuning in and sticking with it. I appreciate the support. Hopefully, next time, we'll be able to make some more progress in the Ice Palace. But until then, I've been Nock. You've been awesome. See ya.